What's up, guys? Praise the Lord. This is the hot man a minute. I got a quick word tonight. And I just want to look, I want to share a scripture with you. And, and many of you know this scripture. And I just want you to think about where you're at right now and, and where your walk's at, where your family's at, where you're everything, every aspect of your life. I want you to stop and reflect from God's point of view where you're at right now. And let's look at the scripture. Amen. In Mark chapter 5, it's talking about the gathering, the demon-possessed man that comes out of the clefts, and Jesus casts the demon legion out of him into the swine. I want to look at this one verse. Mark 5, 19 in the Greek says, And he did not permit him, because remember the man, after he got deliverance, and in his sound mind, he wanted to follow Jesus. But Jesus did not permit him. But he said to him, Go to the home of you and to your own and report to them how much, now look at this, how much the Lord for you did and had mercy on you. Remember how much the Lord has done for you and how the Lord has had mercy on you. The English, go home to your friends and tell them what great things, what great things the Lord has done for you and how he has had compassion on you. <laughs> Does that like sound like God's being angry? <laughs> you know what I mean? God had compassion on you. Think of the great things the Lord has done in your life. And now think about how you've treated others, how you've shown others, the example that you have set for others. Has that example shown compassion and wonderful things of the Lord? If it has, amen. But if it hasn't, this is a good time for reflection, guys. This is a good time for repentance. This is a good time for correction, amen. Jesus is so loving and so merciful and so full of compassion that your human brain and heart will never be able to even fathom what that truly means, okay? He's long-suffering with you and patient, okay? And he sends you to your own right there in your house where you're being rejected right there in your neighborhood where you're being rejected and abandoned and all that stuff that's where jesus sends you amen so i just wanted to share this quick word with you guys i love you guys have a blessed day